Mr. Mustaine, you need to start this riff.
Metal Militia. All right. How do you go? How do you go after that? You bring up. You bring up more people. Is what you do. Lars, you wanna. You wanna talk a little bit? <laughs> so we got two people that are gonna join us for the last song. Um, when I first met James, in the, with Hugh Tanner, he hadn't introduced me to this guy that's coming up. But when I came back from spending the summer, and with Diamond Head, and wanted to uh, start a band, as we talked about the other day. He was living with this guy that's gonna come up and join us now, who became Metallica's first bass player. James's roommate, James's housemate, please welcome on the stage with Metallica for the first time in 29 years, Ron McGovney. Yeah! Sporting one of the original t-shirts there. <laughs> And um, so my version of Hugh Tanner, who you guys met a few, a few minutes ago, um, before I met James and, um, and all that stuff, the first guy that I actually played music with in America when I decided to, uh, to want to go down that path, the first guy that answered my ad is the guy that's going to come up and join us. And on our version of Hit the Lights, that was on my friend Brian's, Brian's uh, label up there, Metal Massacre, uh, the first thing that Metallica ever put out. The following gentleman played all the guitar solos. Ron Quintana, you know his name? There you go. Please give a warm welcome for the first time on stage ever with Metallica, actually, Lloyd Grant. Yeah! All right, Lloyd. Thought you were gonna let your hair down, man. So we're gonna take a, a, a path down the uh, memory lane and uh, see if we can rip out the first song that Metallica ever recorded together that came out on my friend Brian's label. Thank you, Brian, for uh, following through on your promise of putting this song on your compilation album. You guys know the name of this one, right? <laughs> 